We're getting a call, folks. Is it the rape phone? Is it the torture phone? Is it the genocide phone? Is it the I'm being hunted by wolves phone? Is it the help I'm accidentally starring in bestiality porn phone? Is it the cat call phone? Is it the somebody called me bossy phone? Is it the I want things for free and I'm not getting them phone? Is it the some scientist is wearing the image of our prophet phone? Guys, it's all the phones. All the phones? You know what this means? Victim fight! No, you. <laughs> Where I come from, wombat is a dirty word. Where I come from, any word you use for a wombat is a dirty word. My society reduces men to nothing but a dirty word. My society reduces men to nothing but dirt. Ha! Dirt! My society pushes me to the sidewalk so the dirt can walk across me. Sidewalk? You're allowed to use sidewalks in my society. Wombats are forced to wade through the sewers. You have sewers in my society. The wombats have to collect everyone else's waste products and recycle them into sandwiches. They go from house to house at midnight, climbing up people's U-bands like the anal equivalent of Santa Claus. You, uh... You have jobs in industrial sectors? Where I come from, wombats aren't allowed to work. We're forced to stay indoors while everyone else enjoys the pungent fruits of our labor. Indoors? God damn it. We only get to go indoors when we're being used to incubate cruel genetic experiments in our bodies. We only get to go outdoors for that. Every winter, they string us up like a lantern on the porch, hoping we'll turn into a butterfly in the spring. And we never do. But then try it again anyway, because screw it, they're only wombats. So where the hell do we start? Don't touch the poop. Why not? It's cubic. Look, at the North Pole of Saturn, there's a giant hexagon. And I'm not saying it's aliens, I just don't trust it. Nor do I trust anything with a square anus. Or any polygonal anus. Really? Starfish loves you. That doesn't count. Polygonal? You have to save me! No, you have to save me! Okay, so what sort of problems are we talking about? Don't touch the poop! I'm not I'm not touching the poop, I'm just curious. What from what do you respectively need saving? The There's grass is ripe in my Yeah, I didn't catch either of those things, but what would you like us to do? Get the grass to rape somebody else! Hey, there's a bug in my ass! Put the bug in someone else's ass! Hey, there's a bug in my ass! Get the grass is Told you. At this point, the most interesting and coherent thing they can do is poop. Yeah, I kind of want to see that. I was locked in a sex dungeon for a thousand years. They kept me alive using morphine and beeswax. They kept you alive? I was kept in a laboratory where they electrocuted me in the brain until I died. And then they electrocuted me in the heart until I came back to life. And they did it every hour on the hour since the beginning of time just because they felt like it. I'm in constant agony from the cactus that got lodged in my brain from a freak accident involving a meteor, a stampede, a kidnapping, and then another meteor. A freak accident? I got a giant sequoia in my eye. Somebody put it there just because they hate one. Wombats. Eyes? You had eyes? They replaced my eyes with pineapple chunks because they were on sale. I've never even seen a pineapple. I've only felt them as they've been fired up my ass from a bazooka. Feels sort of like someone should be taking some kind of action. Shh, just watch. In its own little way, it's kind of beautiful. They gave me thrush of the dysentery of the cancer of the AIDS. They gave me PTSD. I've got a Death Star pointing at me. So have I. That's my Death Star. No, it isn't. You stole no, it. No, you. No, you are. No, you're. Hey, hey. I said no more destroying the world. <laughs> Just for that, you don't get a decent ending. It's thoughtful and nonviolent. And you know what? I can't even be bothered with the metaphors anymore. Yeah, this show is about feminists and what a bunch of assholes they are. Now fuck off.